Okay, so the headline reads, Donald Trump holds lead for GOP nomination and soars in expectations. 64% of Republicans and Republican-leaning independents now expect him to be the nominee, and that's up sharply within the last two months. That's according to an ABC News poll. Even if you read that Ted Cruz is neck and neck with Trump in other states, that doesn't necessarily seem to be the case here in South Carolina. The lead is wider. Today in Lexington County, Trump will appear at a campaign stop at Harmon's Tree Farm. There's no word if he'll partake in the chicken bog that will be served up to all the attendees. We do know that former longtime state lawmaker Jake Knotts will officially endorse Trump. Yes, the man who famously or infamously called the president and our governor a derogatory name says that he has invited everybody he knows to come out to stump for Trump. Noss's characterization of Obama and Haley was called racist and now lives on in South Carolina political history, like it or not. He's been out of the public eye for several years, ever since Katrina Sheely won his spot in the South Carolina Senate. And sure, he's been influential out in parts of Lexington County, but his reemergence on the political scene makes me wonder if he's got something cooking other than chicken bog. Could he see Trump's popularity as a no-nonsense candidate as his opportunity to step back into the game of politics? We shall see.